This question is from the physics model paper 1 of 2024-25. Question number 44. An AC source of frequency 50 Hz is connected in series with an inductor of 1 Henry, a capacitor of 90 microfarad and a resistor of 100 ohms. Does the current leads or lags the voltage? Calculate the phase difference between the current and the voltage. Now, let us write what is given. Frequency, an AC source of frequency 50 Hz. So, F is equal to 50 Hz. Uh, connected in series with an inductor of 1 Henry. So, L equal to 1 Henry. Capacitor of 90 microfarad. Capacitor value is 90 microfarad. That is nothing but 90 into 10 to the power of minus 6 farad. And a resistor of 100 ohms. Resistor value is 100 ohms. Now, we know that angular frequency omega is 2 pi f and inductive reactance XL is 2 pi FL. This 2 pi F, uh, we can replace it by angular frequency omega, so omega L and uh, capacitive reactance XC equal to 1 by 2 pi FC. Again, I am replacing this 2 pi F by omega, so XC can be written as 1 by omega C. So, we, using these formulas, we will find the values for XL and XC. So, we know that omega equal to 2 pi F is nothing but 2 into 3.141 into frequency is 50 hertz so 50 so omega equal to 3 314 radian per second now let us calculate the inductive reactance xl that is 2 pi fl so we can write this as omega into l or omega is 314 into inductant value is 1. So, we get it as 314 ohms. So, inductive reactance XL equal to 314 ohms. Now, we will calculate the capacitive reactance. Capacitive reactance XC equal to 1 by 2 pi FC which is equal to 1 by omega into C or you can write it as 1 by omega is 314 into capacitance value is 90 into 10 to the power of minus 6. So, this can be written as 35.38 ohms. Now, let us compare the values of XL and XC. If Inductive reactance XL is greater than the capacitive reactance XC, then we can say that current lags the voltage. Here we can see that XL equal to 314 ohms and XC equal to 35.38 ohms. So, your inductive reactance XL is greater than capacitive reactance SC. Therefore, the current lags the voltage. Now, let us calculate the impedance X. Impedance X is given by XL minus XC. XL is 314 minus XC is 35.38 ohms. So, your X is 278.6. Now, we will find the phase difference between the current and the voltage. The phase angle between current and voltage is given by tan pi equal to x by r. Tan pi is given by x by r. x is nothing but 278.6 ohms. So, 278.6 divided by r, r is 100. 100. So, tan pi is nothing but 2.786 or phi is tan inverse of 2.786. Now, using the log book, we can find the value of 2.786. So, the phase difference is nothing but 70.1 degree. So, the final answer is current lags the voltage and 
the phase difference phi is nothing but 70.1 degree.